In today's video, I'm going to show you that how to customize your Windows 11 25 S2 and this is what your desktop look like after end of this video, clean, modern and completely transformed. Hi, welcome back to the channel. So for today, I'm going to show you that how to use a custom theme on Windows 11 latest version, Windows 25 S2. Here you can see my Windows 11 version is 25 S2 OS build 2620057 So first thing first, we have to create a restore point in case anything goes wrong. You can revert your system. Just click on search and type create and then click on create a restore point and then in here you need to select your local disk C and then click on configure and make it around 90% and then click on apply and then ok now click on create and give it a name and then click on create now we need to ready our system for using custom theme just use these tools or check the links are given in the description below for how to ready your system for using a custom theme so right click on it and then click on extract files and then click on ok now cut this folder and go to your local disk c folder and paste it here and then open this folder and here you can see this theme tool just right click on it and then click on run as administrator and then click on yes and then click on ok and then you need to check these two boxes and then click on install so it will record reboot after reboot your system is ready to install a custom theme so just unzip this custom theme file and go to this theme folder and copy these theme files just go to c drive and go to windows go to resources and go to this theme directory and then paste it here and then click on continue and then click on this pc and go to local disk c and then open this SecureX theme folder and right click on this theme tool and then click on run as administrator and then click on yes and here you can see this theme just select that theme and then click on apply okay so theme has been applied here you can see the theme has been applied so now we need to apply the custom icon pack to do that you need to use this software called 70sp just unzip this file and open this folder just uh, you need to rename it to ee2exe and rename this icon pack as well and then open 70sp folder and run this tool click on yes and then click on add custom pack and select that icon pack and then click on start and then click on yes so it will take some time to complete the process so i'll be right back after completing this process okay so process has been complete now click on yes to reboot your computer okay so icon pack has been applied here you can see this new icon pack now we need to use this software called start all back to give some minimalist look on your windows 11 explorer and then click on install for everyone or you can use install for me and then close this pop-up then right click on taskbar and then click on properties and turn off this taskbar and then click on restart now and go to start menu and start menu and also turn this off and then go to explorer tab and then select this windows 7 command bar okay now it's done and now if you want to add some blur effect on your windows 11 explorer you can use this software called blarmica you need to download this software called blarmica then cut this unzip this and cut this folder into c drive and then open this folder and just click on this register and then click on run as administrator and then click on yes and then click on ok so it will add blur effect on your windows 11 explorer 
and let me show you this my configuration here you can see my configuration and that's it if you found this video helpful please subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in the next customization video